Hi, welcome to the scrapyard. I'm Red. Uh, just a few things today. I got shop card shout out. Uh, Terry's. I've been waiting on his card for a while. He uh, had some problems with his internet or something, but uh, you need to go check him out, man. He's he's got a uh, he's got a really good channel. Um, that's his channel name, Terry's Models. Um, Oh, I'm not getting on in frame. Look at that. Raise that up a little bit. There we go. <laughs> Get a better look at that shop card now. Alright. Been getting a little work done. Get the paint on the Diora. Um, let me put some light on this. Watch it overload the camera. I was going to try to do a, a fade with that yellow on the gold, but it uh, was way too subtle, so I just coated the whole thing with a transparent amber over the gold. It shifted the color more yellow. Uh, compare it to the the base gold that was what I used on the uh, Dragula. Um, that's coming right along. I'm still monkeying around with the interior a little bit. Um, let's see. Got the seats painted. I think I want to got an insert in them right and I'm thinking I want to go with the insert uh, like a like a gold colored not gold like this gold but um, no gold like uh, uh, Captain Kirk shirt on Star Trek at first season <laughs> that kind of gold um, yeah I re, I re uh, reapplied the uh, embossing powder so now it looks a lot better um, I'm going with the kit wheels I mean the kit tires I don't really like them but it needs a 14 inch tire and those are the right wheels for the car there's a really nice set of uh, Anson's came with it too. I'll use them somewhere else. <laughs> but uh, anyway, it's coming right along. Slide that back in there for now. Um, set it back out of the way. I'm fixing to turn my work mesh kind of apart and re redo everything. Uh, the Dragula's coming along. Um, There's my plastic tires nobody likes. And check it out. They're actually, they're uh, cuter slicks. <laughs> but uh, I cut the, uh, I cut the rear end loose from the transmission because it was, it looked twisted to me. I mean, it was easy enough, but though it's, it, there's only one place it can go. I mean, it all locks in place there, and then the, the rear end will fit right in there like that. Not much detail really on these kits, but it does have a neat little engine. Um, these th three kits, these three show cars, this Dragula, the Monsters Coach, and this Diora, all of them are just, you can't really build an accurate replica with them. <laughs> Let's just put it that way, but uh, but you know they're fun little kids. Um, this is going to be box stock as well. I, I, the only thing I did to it was I uh, put some of my uh, homemade tuck and roll in there, just so that it won't look so bare down in there, you know. But uh, 
but it's coming right along. The chintzy little front front tires. <laughs> Some really bad wheels, man. <laughs> but like I said, I'm building it box stock. It'll be all right. I've always liked the. Uh, I mean, it's got some good parts in it, man. It does, man. The little engine's all right. The carburetors suck, but the engine's all right. Um, I mean, it's got things over like this uh, brake with the uh, master cylinder on it. And, you know, that's a pretty neat little part. And it has my favorite scoop set up ever for... I mean, it's just wicked looking. You know. But, uh, oh, everybody knows what this looks like. I mean, yeah. But, uh, I tell you what, there's a guy on eBay right now got got the Graveyard Duo. I mean, the, uh, yeah, the Ghoulish Duo, or whatever they, whatever they called it when they brought it out in the off brand, uh, you know, off name, uh, not as the Monsters Coast and Dragula, but, um, this guy on eBay got them for less than $40 shipped, I think it's like $36 shipped, free shipping on them, you know, so, uh, you need, if you, if you want one of these, that's going to be the best way to get it, because, you, I mean, you see what they bring, man, hell, I think I got lucky when I got mine, I got it pretty cheap, it was a blue printer. Um, I don't think I give like I give a little 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 bit extra for it, but you know it wasn't that expensive. Uh, I mean, you know, at the time I think I give like thirty bucks, maybe thirty five. But you know, I, um, it's one I always wanted. You know, I probably had it two or three times when I was a kid. But you know, you know how it is when you're a kid. These things are a little, little more than toys anyway, I man. You know, like, like I said, they're not high on detail. You can't really build an accurate replica. I mean, it's... But they, you know, going on a shelf, it'll be something to look at. Something might get finished anyway. Anyway, that's all I got for tonight. Um, Y'all have a good night, and uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye.